These 12 characteristics of good teaching practice by Bella, many students find really useful. The teaching and learning is based on a needs assessment. There is an identified need for the learning to occur. The good teaching occurs in an environment which is a safe environment. Now, in an occupational health and safety sense, there are issues to do with fast-moving machinery and so on and so forth. What Bella's talking about is an environment where people feel safe to discuss openly, to suggest ideas, make comments, where people's ideas are going to be respected. And for those of you who work in industry, that can be a really important part of what you need to do when there is suspicion on the part of people who've been forced to come and spend time with you that there's some other agenda. Developing sound relationships between learners, with learners, between learners and teachers and so on, and trying to encourage those relationships where there's a level of trust. The notion of sequencing and reinforcement, these relate back really to those notions of behaviourist learning theory. Also the notion of praxis, the linking of theory and practice. So rather than teaching theory separate from practice, trying to theory and practice to come together in an applied sort of way. Rather than asking someone to write an essay, you might ask students to become actively engaged in the debate. Uh, Mutual respect we talked about. Regard for ideas, feelings and uh, actions. You can see there's an awful lot to hear to do with person-to-person relationships. Immediacy is the notion that it's important to respond to what's happening as quickly as possible. She talks about the importance of people being clear about what their roles are. What are the boundaries? Engaging in teamwork, what that means will depend on what it is you're doing. The teamwork might be us all working together, a small group of you guys working together. It also means me working with other people in a similar discipline area and so on. Um, This notion of engagement is an interesting idea that people learn better when they're engaged. Um, The question is engagement. Also, Vella talks about this notion of accountability, that it's important that learners are accountable for what they do.